My name is Kelvin Do and I am an inventor. I'm from Sierra Leone. I live in the city called Freetown. When I was 11, I started picking up scrap electronic items from trash areas. I realized with scrap, I could still make things work like my battery, an FM radio station. People normally call me DJ Focus in my community because I believe if you focus, you can do invention um, perfectly. When it was posted on YouTube, so many people watched my video and they were so impacted about my story, my invention. People sent in a lot of good comments and I was so delighted about it. The inspirational effect of the original Thinker YouTube video has been remarkable. It has had a tremendous amount of impact on Kelvin's life, on my life, and on millions of people all around the world, everywhere, in Sierra Leone, where other young people suddenly feel like they can be like Kelvin. After the video, with all the press and with all the media, great, great opportunities have become available to Kelvin. One of them was the TEDx Teen community, and they reached out to us and invited Kelvin to be one of the speakers. Um, and we are very, very excited about this presentation, and I'm very proud of him. Uh, he's doing things that we never imagined he, he will be doing. When I arrived at the hotel, a man stopped me and said to me that, I saw you, I saw you on YouTube, and I was like, <laughs> I could not believe it. Elevator straight to the center of the lobby, and then here, Edgar will be able to assist you upstairs. Thank you. Enjoy Thank your stay, you. all the best. Okay, Whoa. I've never stayed in an hotel before. This is my first time. <laughs> the bed is so soft, and it's good. This is the, the, the gorilla I met on the bed. I don't like it. <laughs> I had done a Google search and somehow Kelvin's YouTube video came up and before I'd gotten through half of it, I was already tweeting David Senge, his mentor here in the States, to try and get contact information. When I'm putting together a conference, I need to make sure that every walk of life is represented and I really wanted to find a youth that had invented something or had that kind of imagination that took something normal and made it extraordinary. And obviously Kelvin's story spoke volumes to that. It takes me two weeks to prepare my presentation. This is my first time talking to a lot of people, so I feel a little bit nervous. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited, so much excited. I feel so good because I want the audience to learn from it and also to always follow their passion. Right, like you don't even have to worry. I think you got it down. You're yeah. gonna be like the, the best guy on stage, okay? Excited? Yeah, I'm excited. Excited, like ready to go? <laughs> Our next speaker, Kelvin Doe, is also someone who refused to see limitations, and who took what he could find and reimagined something that probably did indeed seem impossible. And he's now not only having an impact on his community, but having great resonance around the world. Kelvin. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. My name is Kelvin Do, AKA DJ Focus. <laughs> I was born on the 26th October, 1996. I am a proud Sierra Union. I live in a small community town in Freetown called Wazak Farm. I am the youngest in a family of five children. I was raised up single-handedly by my mother. Our resilience and self-belief made it possible for me to be alive today. 
My creative instincts were always present, even as a little kid. At the age of 11, I started picking up scrap electronic items from trash areas on my way home because I was too poor to afford new parts. And once I got the part that I want, I would go to bed at around 7 p.m. and I would wake up after midnight when everybody was asleep. <laughs> my mother would wake up most nights to see a living room transform into a small electronic scrapyard. <laughs> and she would insist that I go back to bed. I ended up building a three-channel mixer, a sound amplifier, and a microphone receiver. Putting all of these together, I discovered I had built a music set. I soon became a DJ, and I took the name DJ Focus. <laughs> DJ Focus. <laughs> I started playing music for people in my community, and I will normally DJ like this. Stand up, the great philosopher in the building, baby. <laughs> it's the biggest, the hottest, the famous DJ in the old municipality. Kicking the album banging. This is the biggest heavy way to go. It's still in the making, baby. It's the nation pride. Beyond your imagination, it's the most wanted DJ. I and I DJ man focus. <laughs> At the age of 14, I started thinking about what I could do that could be bigger than my music set. It came to me that I can make my own radio station and become a DJ there. It was tough and hard. I spent many frustrating nights, trying and failing. But nevertheless, I persevered until I completed the project. Then the fame started. The national television station in Sierra Leone Soon heard about what I had done and put me on ear for a live demonstration. Then an amazing opportunity came to me and I became the youngest visiting practitioner at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT. <laughs> David Sanger, the founder of Global Minimum and Innovate Salon, got think I to do a video of my story, which was um, later posted on YouTube. At the latest count, this video has had more than 4.1 million viewers. Somebody mentioned to me that my video was even more popular than that of President Obama's victory speech. <laughs> <laughs> After um, his election, which had 2.9 million viewers. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> Since then, my story has been carried on news channels around the world, and I am greatly humbled and delighted by this. And if I'm asked to summarize the lessons of my life so far, there is one thing that I will say. Creativity is universal and can be found in places where one does not expect to find it. And perseverance and passion are essential to nurturing that creative ability. So now that you know my own story, I urge you to look for young people with talent, creative abilities, and passion in all places. Not just in places you might expect to find it. And I ask you to support these young people, just as so many people have supported me. You never know, you might find the next DJ Focus. Thank you. <laughs> DJ Focus! DJ Focus! DJ Focus! Yeah. Right before Kelvin stuck, I was very nervous. Because I knew he had prepared, I knew he'd put in a lot of work into this talk, and I, I just wanted it to flow, and, and all the things that he did was, was, was absolutely wonderful. As soon as he got up on stage, I mean, it was DJ Focus. It wasn't Kelvin anymore, it was DJ Focus. <laughs> And he just commanded that entire room. For me, it was a very special moment uh, sitting in there and watching Kelvin and how everybody in the room was so electrified by his presentation. It makes me feel good because I think my mom would be proud of me. Yeah. My name is Kelvin Doe, aka DJ Focus. Live in New York, representing 
Sierra Leone, this city to the world, I want you to subscribe to Tinka. In Sierra Leone, we have not too much electricity. Lights will come um, once in a week and uh, the rest of the month are dark. So I made my own battery to power lights in people's houses.